Hi, James Milan is James the Wine Guy here to share and celebrate this wine, this producer with you today. This is called Lenay, Lenay, Willamette Valley Pinot Noir 2010 Vintage and uh, back panel for your, your review here. Now, looking at the front label, this is important. When you think of nose, without this, we would not get the full spectrum characteristic of what we scent and experience from wine, food, and other beverages. So extremely important. So I definitely want to point out for you the dominant label program here for Linnae wine. So here is the one you see for most of their wines, except for this particular bottling. Now for me, this is a producer that is uh, has a really nice set of um, uh, clones. They have Pomard 115, 114, 777, and 667. Now for me, um, you know, I think of um, this great year, uh, 2012, is when I'm tasting through so many amazing Pinot Noir from not just Yamhill Carlton, but the entire Willamette Valley in, in its entirety, as well as other areas in Oregon. And for me, there is a markedly different characteristic that is coming from this state. It is um, compared to California and uh, maybe other wine, uh, Pinot Noir producing regions around the world. It is markedly different. Sometimes it's compared to uh, Burgundy, which I think is unfair. It should be uh, given its own descriptors and its own um, reviews on its own terms because really it's Oregon Pinot Noir at day's end. So for me, this is a beautiful, handsome, well-crafted wine. I did open this up about half an hour ago, and for me, it was a really great way of just opening up this wine. While I think on my first sip from just opening this wine was very different from what I'm tasting right now. Um, the nuances have come out. It's just really much more evocative than it was before. So beautiful scent characteristics on this wine. Uh, beautiful notes of violet, uh, warm leather by touch, herb garden in evening time. So here we go, I'll take a taste and give you some flavor characteristics. Mm. Beautiful notes of wild strawberry, rose petal, cinnamon, chocolate, red tea, and a micro hint of marjoram. Give this wine a 9.0 out of a 10.0 scale. For more wine reviews, please go to jamesthewineguy.com. Please subscribe to my videos on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google+, Pinterest. Salud.